The scene was the gymnasium at Jean Child's Young Middle School at the end of the first week of classes for the new school year. The reason that everyone is here today on this podium and excited to be here is because we want Jean Child's Young Middle School to be the best middle school, not in Atlanta, not the best middle school in the state of Georgia, but the best middle school in the United States. How about that? There were elements of a traditional pep rally complete with cheerleaders, but the theme of the event was much more important than cheering on the home team. Everything I've accomplished in my life, being the 59th mayor of the city of Atlanta by the time I was 40 years old, everything Lamar's done, everything Keisha's done, everything Caesar C. Mitchell, who's the president of the Atlanta City Council, has done, came out of a public school education from this community. What would you do if you weren't afraid to fail? And I was so excited to see the people dancing out here. When I ask that question, I get all kinds of answers, but when I ask myself that question, what would I do if I weren't afraid to fail, I'd probably get out and dance in the middle of the floor. The rally was about taking chances and committing to success in school and beyond. It was a theme that certainly resonated with the students. My academics, I got to do my work if I want to play football. Mm -hmm. So how do you do that? I just stay in class, no skipping, mm -hmm. stay in school. And make it work? Make A's, good grades. This year I'm looking forward to being at the football games and basketball games. And I'm just, I wanted to, I want to do more than I did last year and have a better GPA. And how are you going to achieve that? By studying more, um, doing extra credit when it's, when it's, um, um, giving out. At the rally, a lot of energy was released through dancing and cheering, culminating a first full week of teaching and learning. Beyond all the excitement, the quiet lessons of the day were certainly not lost on this audience of students and their supporters. You've made it. You made the first week. Give yourselves a round of applause. While a lot of noise was certainly made in the gym Friday afternoon, everyone here was also well aware of the fact that the more important activities would begin all over again Monday morning in classrooms throughout Jean Child's Young Middle School.